By the cruelest coincidental irony, Warrior's new banners are unnecessary in the very role they were meant to enable. That's the second big stupid ain't pull off by the same patch. Most efficient way to provide quickness comes through Warhorn 4 and Martial Cadence, with related cooldowns being 16 and 8, as well as the quickness duration being 6 and 4. You can see how it's possible to upkeep quickness fully without a single ban. However, that goes down south very quickly once applied into practice. You see, Marching Orders, the thing that applies Soldier's Focus, has bigger cooldown than Burst skills that expand the focus, triggering Martial Cadence, which forces you to wait before bursting if you want to upkeep quickness, which is both suboptimal and annoying. Cast times of abilities also throw a bloody wrench into the equation. But let's hypothetically assume that Soldier's Focus gets its base cooldown reduced to 8 and Martial Cadence gets its base quickness reduced to 2.5 seconds. Now Burst skill and Soldier's Focus interact smoothly, and since it takes now 48 seconds to supply 47 seconds of quickness, the need for banners actually exists. Furthermore, Singular Banner is enough to cover that gap without need for doubled standards, and allowing us to take something actually worth taking instead. Unfortunately, Berserker won't be able to benefit from this change since his class mechanic forces periods of rapid bursting and stop periods that. of no bursting at You're all. You're not gonna stop on my screen. You're not gonna come here and stop. I think Berserker should be able to upkeep quickness. However, Berserker shouldn't be best at everything. I would make Blood Reckoning refresh Soldier's Focus to allow Berserker to upkeep quickness with doubled standards. Spellbreaker's full counter should refresh focus as well, giving him at least one comfortable spot in PvE meta as the easy quickness guy. Bloodsworn would do fine with new system. He wouldn't be preferred quickness warrior, but he certainly could perform this function well enough. When it comes to banners themselves, the biggest concern I have is that this area is emptier than my bank account. Returning to the roots is the way to go here. Banners should have their own weapon skills just as weapon kits do, but with skills 1 to 3 and 5 sharing effects and cooldowns, and skill 4 being unique for every banner. Banners don't need to have their own burst skills. They can, but they work fine with existing ones, as long as we ignore the... In other words, we are swimming quite close to the surface. A simple change to two traits, counting the Unholy Ars Fuckery, and increase to some numbers would bring Warrior back to relevancy, and that is with the way to chew off a bit of that Boon Hero role. And banners getting the mentioned before changes would shake up and refresh some of the stale Warrior builds in all three game modes. Crap face out.